violence on the streets of Mombasa. Arson on the Salvation Army Church and Majengo and death. All this the aftermath of Muslim cleric Sheikh Ibrahim Rogo's cold blood murder. <laughs> Unknown gunmen killed Sheikh Rogo alongside three other men at 10 p.m. last night near the Bamburi police station while driving to his residence in Mutwapa from the Masjid Mosa Mosque. Sheikh Abudu walimuwa pale mbele. Ivi ivi. Sheikh Ibrahim ni mwalimu anafundisha Masjid Sunna hapo Mtwapa na anadarsa kwa wiki mara moja Masjid Musa. Yeye ndo aloshika pahali pa Sheikh Abu Drogo. Only one man survived the onslaught out of the five occupants in the car. Tukifika White Sand ghafla tulisikia milio ya risasi na kwanza tukujua kama ni risasi. Lakini baadaye ndio tuligundua ni risasi. Na ikawa sana zinawapiga wenzangu kwa sababu walikuwa uko upande wa right wote. Na mwenye anapiga actually alikuwa uko upande wa right. Finger pointing over who was responsible for Sheikh Rogo's assassination has now started. I deny categorically that uh, police in this case are involved because I have got my policemen intact within this command. There were a lot of rounds fired there. It is impossible that police at the Bamburi police station didn't hear the sound. But do you see any policemen now? I'm blaming the clutch, those people, those, uh, those people who came. Makaburi and others for preventing us. We were carrying out on without our with our investigation. So they disturbed the scene, of which it was very necessary for us. And as I am talking now, they have buried the bodies without postmortems being carried out. Dead and buried the same night. Sheikh Ibrahim Rogo's murder came on the eve of the Friday prayers, stalking emotions from his supporters. The aftermath of which destruction and mayhem that has led to the death of four other people in Kisauni area and the wounding of eight others who are now recuperating at the Coast General Hospital. About 30 people were arrested in connection with the protests even as the Mombasa County Police Commandant said that Sheikh Abu Bakar Sharif, alias Makaburi, was being sought after allegedly for obstructing the police from conducting crucial investigations at the crime scene. We are also going to, to investigate him as to why he is coming very fast. Who is telling them this kind of acts? Who is telling him? Because no other person arrived. But he came with a, a contingent of other clergymen and the press. So he, it seems he knows more than what we know. Last Saturday, Makaburi claimed that his life and two other clerics, including the slain Sheikh Rogo's lives, were in danger when word went round that they were dead. Sheikh Ibrahim Rogo's murder has elicited a similar reaction as his successor Abu Rogo's assassination in August last year. Both coincidentally gunned down around the same area along the busy Mombasa Malindi Highway. Sylvia Chibet, Citizen Weekend.